Greetings, friends. Happy Warden Wednesday. Smoking my Cobb Warden with the uh, Walker Briar Works aftermarket bit. And uh, in it today, uh, you know how you get to the bottom of a baggie or a tin and, and you've got, you know, three quarters of a bowl, but not quite a full bowl. And you, at least I do. You just dump it into a baggie, let it accumulate. Well, I've been doing that for a while and my my Franken blend is is kind of getting full, so I just I took out a bowl. Uh, it's actually burning a little hot because <laughs> I've got aromatics and Cavendish and English and all kinds of stuff. Virginias. I'm gonna set it down. Um, the reason I'm making a video today on on uh, Warden Wednesday is recently Jay Piper put up a video uh, showing us his collection. And Jay, I've got to compliment you on your cellar. Um, I know you've not been smoking a pipe uh, for much longer than I have, and you've really amassed quite a nice collection in a, in a short amount of time, so I'm quite envious. Uh, but the reason I'm mentioning that is because in your video, you talked about price point, and it really hit home with me. Uh, recently, uh, I got a Meerschaum pipe, as you all know, from Danny Shore, and uh, Dan Boswell had recommended to me that I smoke a Black Cavendish in it, and I love it. I, I got some of their blend, Smoker's Choice, and I've got some Lane BCA that I've smoked in it. And since then, I've uh, also cut my Englishes, like uh, Seattle Club Plum Pudding, uh, Seattle Club Mississippi River, uh, Blue Mountain, uh, Northwoods, all of those Englishes I've cut with a little bit of BCA. And for me, I think I found the perfect taste uh, for when I sit down to enjoy a smoke. It's, there's a combination of that black Cavendish and that English that just, that really, really suits me. So uh, with Boswell's, if I order one ounce or 10 pounds, their price is the same. They don't give a price break for quantity, like a lot of places do. Uh, and I'm not sure why. It, it's not a question I've ever posed to JM, so I may have to ask him that one day, of, you know, why they do that. When I first started going in there, if you went into the store and paid cash, the uh, prices per ounce were a little less. They gave you a price break. But now, about a month and a half, maybe two months ago, they all across the board, whether you order online with a credit card or whether you walk into the store and pay cash or credit, all their blends are the same across the board. They're what they call their back shelf blends, uh, Northwoods, Countryside, Mild English, $4 and a quarter across the board, whether you order one ounce or 10 pounds. All their aromatics are $3 an ounce, whether you order one ounce or 10 pounds. Uh, Recently, I made a purchase from Pipes and Cigars, and I got a half a pound of Lane BCA, and at the 8-ounce uh, point, the price came down to $1.77 an ounce. So the purpose of this video is I'm kind of, you know, kind of making a call out to the community. If anybody knows of an English blend in bulk that is similar to a plum pudding or a Mississippi River, or Blue Mountain, or Northwoods. Uh, those, those are my favorites right now uh, that I've smoked. Uh, let me know. Let me know if there's a blend out there where if I buy it in bulk, I can get that price point down to maybe under $2 an ounce. Um, because, you know, as much as I love Northwoods, or as much as I like uh, Blue Mountain, I don't want to pay the premium price if I can get the same taste, the same smoke at a lower price point. So um, either leave a comment on this video or uh, send me a PM or make your own video and let everybody know. Say, hey folks, here, here are some English blends that you can buy in bulk and uh, you know, depending on how much you buy, you can really bring that price point down. So uh, thanks again for watching. And uh, until we meet again, friends, happy trails.